Hello and welcome to the Red Men TV. It's player ratings time as Liverpool ran out 2-1 winners and put some pressure on West Ham, Man United and Southampton in the Premier League. Uh, we've got a big game coming up against Everton in the week, of course. But right now, we're here to look at the Bournemouth player ratings. So I'm going to start with the goalkeeper, Danny Ward. I thought he did really well, to be honest with you. Look, last five minutes, he got a little bit nervy, I think. And I think that's understandable. He was under some pressure. There's some high balls going into the box. But I still think... Throughout the match, I think he did absolutely brilliant. He looked like a goalkeeper. He looked like a goalkeeper who's used to coming for crosses, catching the ball and releasing it fairly quickly. So for me, I'm going to give him a seven and a half. Moving on to right back, Randall. I'm going to give him a seven. I thought he did all right. Um, no, actually, I'm going to give him a six and a half. I thought he did all right. I think he, he, he did well defensively at times. Didn't offer as much, obviously, as Nathaniel Klein does going forwards. But there you know, who does really? Uh, Colotoy, I'm going to give him a seven. Once again, just looked like a good centre-back. Definitely for me, he's getting younger every week. I don't know if there's like some Benjamin Button style stuff going on with Colo Tori, but I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, his partner, Lucas Lever. I'm going to give him a six. I thought he struggled uh, in the second half slightly, uh, although on the whole, I think he did all right. Um, Brad Smith, I'm going to give him a seven. I thought he, 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 he supported the attack really well at times. Um, and again, look, you know, uh, a young left back getting his first Premier League start. I thought he handled himself really, really well. Um, Kevin Stewart, I'm going to give him a seven. I'm going to give Joe Allen eight. I thought he was just brilliant in the centre back, makes so many tackles again. Uh, but it's the, you know, that, that one where he wins the ball high up the pitch starts the second half uh, and he plays that sort of through ball into Daniel Sturridge that's what Joe Allen's game is he's not just the defensive midfielder he can win the ball high up the pitch he can play these amazing slide roll passes and Sturridge goes chips the keeper and it's the post in the end uh, it was really unlucky Jordan Ibe thought he did brilliantly coming back into the side I'm going to give him an eight Roberto Firmino I'm going to give him a seven even though he got a goal I thought he was Ojo and I were better for me. Um, but, you know, you can still tell that he's coming back from an injury, still gets a goal, so still performing when we need him to. Uh, Shea Ojo, I'm going to give him an eight as well. I thought he was just brilliant. I thought it nice to see him on the pitch, nice to see him stretching his legs and going at defenders. And he gave that right back a torrid time all game long, didn't he? And then up top, I'm going to give Daniel Sturridge... I'm going to give him an eight and a half. I thought he was our best player on the day. I thought when it, whenever he got inside the 18-yard box, he came alive. His quick feet, you know, he's always trying to hit the target. And he just looked like the best player on the pitch for me. And then the substitutes, Origi, I'm going to give him a six. Lalana a seven. And Mamadou Sacco. I'm going to give him... Well, what did I give Lucas? I gave Lucas a six, did I? Uh, I'm going to give him a 5.9 because I don't think he was as good as Lucas Lever, um, mainly because of that one where he tried to shield the ball and they ended up getting a chance from it. But there you go. If you agree or disagree, of course, leave me your player ratings in the comments section below. Uh, I'm now going back to check the Start 11 prediction show because I've got a shout out to do if anyone got that team right. Um, yeah, that won't take me long, I don't think. I can't imagine anybody got that team right. And if you did, fair fucks, yeah, you'll get a shout out on the next show. Uh, anyway, Chris Pajak, Red Ben TV, that was player ratings. Subscribe to the YouTube channel.